So for the past, I don't know, two weeks, my Kindle stopped working. Every time I would um, try to turn it on, it would just stop, um, would either not do anything or it would be making a beeping noise. Um, I did, I went online, searched online, looked for beeping Amazon Kindle tablet, beeping or pressing the power button and I kept on coming out with just reset, push it down, hold it down, the power down for about 30 seconds and then let it go and then two seconds later do it again uh, for two seconds and then that should reset the whole Kindle and start working. Well, I did that a couple of times and no luck. Nothing at all. So I kind of got tired of it. I'm like, you know what? I mean, if my Kindle's already broken, I mean, what what else could I do? I mean, I'm breaking it more than what it is already. So what I did, I went ahead and um, I ended up doing um, opening the Kindle. I opened the Kindle up and took the back off just by prying this out prying it out everything came up the, the back cover just came out nothing was attached to it so you don't have to worry about anything being attached or anything just be careful when you're coming it out that way it doesn't break but uh, I did find the connection for the battery and I end up just um, unplugging the battery for about 30 seconds to a minute and then I went ahead and uh, plug the battery back in there to the Kindle. Um, so after plugging it in, putting it back together, I'm like, you know what, let's try it and see if it works or what or what happens. So I went ahead and did that and voila, Kindle works now. So everything is working, it loads, no problems. So My Kindle is working now and I am glad that I was able to fix it. I had it for about two years and I was kind of disappoint disappointed about it because I'm like, well, I guess that's what it's meant to do and that's it. But no, it still works. Battery lasts a long time and say one one day, uh, maybe you use it a lot, then in that, you know, depending if it's constant use, then you're going to get about two or three hours out of it. But if you use it for five, ten minutes to check a game or read or whatever the case is and put it down, then about a day, day and a half. But I am actually glad that now it's working and I'm able to start using my Kindle back up. Um, so I just wanted to make a quick video about this. Um, like I said, I mean, I search on the Internet about BP noise and I never got an exact answer or uh, response as what to do um, to it or other than just doing the reset so I just wanted to do that and put it on here um, that way if you ever have that beepy noise I mean it's not something that you have to send it into Amazon or have somebody professional look into it or whatever you know like I said just pry it out uh, unplug the battery and then plug it back in there close it you don't have to touch anything else and then turn it on uh, make sure the batteries charge for a while you know that way you know you make sure that there is battery in it but if you have any questions please um comment below um like and subscribe to my channel there's going to be more videos coming out of other reviews um and other stuff or you know who knows what other stuff I, I'm, I'm gonna get and start making reviews on but you know just like and subscribe and if you have like i said if you have any questions let me know and I'll do my best to answer those questions. Thank you for watching. You guys have a great day and goodbye.